Hello, this is the White Room Chronicles. My name's Jack Burness. I'm one of the regulars at the White Room. It's a small independent gallery and coffee shop in Stanley County, Durham. Doing the very best I can for sure. And all I ask is a round of applause. A fair night's pay and I'm all yours. 245 is with the yard on core. So I'm sitting here on a Friday morning. Lovely weather outside, waiting for the Stanley sunrise to get itself up. Oh, there's a funeral car just gone by, that just about sums me. All, all points north and south of the river Tyne. I've been up the stairs and down So I, so I've, I've been playing music for probably 40 years or so. I'm now, once I hit 50, I might retire from it. Um, no, but uh, it's always been a part-time thing with me. Years ago, I did get a, one of the bands I was in uh, called Deep Freeze, we did get a, a glimmer of, um, a glimmer of hope from the record company. Clap and smile, to make it all worthwhile. We, uh, I, um, I joined a rock band as a singer, and then I joined another rock band as a singer. We did a track on an, an album called All Together Now by it was BBC Radio Newcastle, Bedrock Radio program. And they put this album, compilation album together. A lot of, lot of bands on, uh, there's about 11 bands on all together. And um, we, uh, we did that, and then we split up. And then I formed a band uh, called Deep Freeze, which uh, we played for a year or so. It was quite good fun. Then that split up. And then I had another band called The Swingin' Dicks, with a brilliant musician who's dead now called um, Willie Duggan. Uh, fantastic. Played the electric mandolin. Uh, with the, He didn't have the eight strings on. He had, just had four on, so he could bend them like Jimi Hendrix. And he was a fantastic player, but unfortunately he popped his clogs. When he was only 51, that's about uh, four or five years ago now. And um, then I started the business, printing, and then it went quite well. Didn't really advertise. It just, I think it was my my charm that won all the customers over. All for the money. I grew up in Biker. Born there, left when I was about 20, went to Gateshead, got married, then uh, got divorced, went to uh, Low Fell, got married, and uh, then we came up to uh, Stanley area. I live, at, uh, I live in a converted garage, um, which is part of the Beamish, uh, Beamish Hall estate. Uh, literally, literally is a converted garage, and um, but it's very nice. Uh, the only trouble is you've got to move all the furniture when you want to put the car away. But uh, <laughs> all for the money. Have very few hobbies, just music writing poems, writing stories, and drinking coffee, basically. So that's why I'm here today. So there you go. The Road to Oblivion by Jack B. Burness. Dancing down a dog leap stair Working down in Shepherd's Yard